What's going on guys, it is Golazio here, welcome back to another FIFA 19 career mode video. Guys, today this is episode 6, we are proper into the thick of things now, into this season. We got Crystal Palace today, Leeds United newly promoted for the 2020 season. And of course we are going to be playing Bayer Leverkusen and Leicester City this episode as well. For the next episode we are going to be rocking up in the Champions League once again lots and lots of champions league games i cannot wait to get the january if i'm honest cannot wait and we'll be playing in spurs' new stadium as well but guys make sure you do hit that like button and of course if you are new around you hit that subscribe button because this series goes live every monday and friday at 6 p.m it premieres we all get involved in the chat it is pretty awesome but anyway guys let's have a quick look at this league table it is too close for comfort at the moment. Manchester United currently top of the table on goal difference. And we don't play them for another few episodes. So we're going to have to wait and find out and make sure we just keep picking up points as we drop points last episode, which hasn't gone our way. We weren't beat then, but we drew quite a lot of games. So hopefully we start picking up some wins and Manchester United drop a few points before we actually face them which would be absolutely huge for us. See, as you can see, we don't end up playing them anytime soon, which is really unfortunate because it'd be a massive help if we could, even throughout December. But uh, anyway, guys, let's have a quick look at the side we're going to be facing against Crystal Palace. So we have made a couple of changes. Purely down the tiredness. Tonali is not featuring this week. Barry Barnum is in the side. And it's the same for Roas as well. If you missed last episode, we played in the Champions League against Bayer Leverkusen. So um, a lot of players are tired from that midweek game. So Great Leash is still in it. A lot of players still high on fitness though, which is pretty decent. But some of them have got to be dropped. But I'm happy enough to put Travis and Barnum into the side because they're very good players. Zaniolo, unfortunately, fitness still isn't full enough. So Dom take one and risk him for to bring one as a sub, along that with Bradley Dack. But anyway, guys, let's jump into this first game against Palace. Hi there, everybody. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith is with me, and we're at Selhurst Park. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Wayne Hennessy plays in goal. Pap Suarez does, with Joel Ward in the fullback positions. James McArthur plays with Jordan Much in the centre of the park. And the last player on the team sheet is the one main forward. Lampard Rovers will line up like this. Jack Grealish starts, a midfielder in good form. And here they are, the three forwards in today's formation. Out wide to Arnowski. Little through ball to Timothy Way. Timothy Way is looking for a little square back. Oh, it's cleared. Travis. Way. Oh, I don't know who that is. Why did I say Way? <laughs> I don't know who that was, but it was an initial good chance. And it goes back in 10 minutes in. Travis now. Barry Bannum. Trying to line Barry Bannum up on his left foot, but it's not happening at all. Timothy Way. Oh, is Alfonso Davis actually? He's come through. Awful shot. Awful shot. As I was Brill. Barry Bannum. Now Wilson. Nice. Travis. Travis. Oh, Davis. Yes, come on. We've put it into the back of the net. Finally, I thought it was going wide once again, but we put the ball in. We're 1-0 up on the hour mark. We need to maintain this now and make sure we don't concede straight away, which was a common theme in our Bayer Leverkusen game. But lovely play. One-touch football. First touch goal, absolutely brilliant. We won a lot, a very thoroughly deserved goal for Blackman Rovers. The century, without a doubt. Get his cross in. Keep that. Oh no! Oh my gosh! Come on, man! EA, I got friggin' EA! What a load of rubbish! What a load of rubbish! Get rid, he takes a touch. I'm holding down X and he falls. What a load of rubbish. What a load of rubbish. I'm sorry, that's ridiculous. What, I knew it. What a load of rubbish. Oh, look, this game is so against me at the minute. Utter rubbish. 
Look at that! Not winning a single ball. What an absolutely ridiculous game. They must have had two chances that entire game. So undeserved. Every time we score at the minute, I'm guaranteed to concede. Guaranteed. It happens all the time. This stuff is constantly against me. I just don't get it. I don't understand it. We dominate from start to finish. Literally dominate the game. I'm trying to get Timothy Way up. I just... It's everything's all the time. It's the same. All the time. It is. I just don't want to. It's, ridiculous. it's just so frustrating. This is constant now. That I can get chance after chance. And the ball goes real wide. And it, I'm doing no... The goals we can see as well is really sloppy. We've dropped now, you can see in the lead. Well, well, we're still in second place. We're five points clear, sec, third. But we've lost the two. We still haven't lost, right? That's huge. But we've conceded so many goals this season. We've only played 10. We conceded six. So we can literally 6% of our games we conceded in. So we need to start picking our wins. I want to play Leeds because I want to hammer them. I want to play, get a big, big win. Um, so I'm going to change the side. This is what I'm actually going to do to the team. Timothy Way is going to be dropped for King. Roas is going to be back in the lineup. Bradley Dant, we missed quite a lot, in all fairness. Travis played really well. I won't lie. Travis played very well. Um, so he's going to stay in the side. And we're going to put Todd Alley there instead. I'm actually going to drop Noski this particular game and put my other left back and wait until... I might loan Noski out in January. Um... And because this, I much prefer this guy, in all fairness. But Norski, I don't want him to leave because he has a really high rating. Um, but this is the side we're going out with. King, Grey Leash uh, back in the side. Roas back in the side as well. But without further ado, let's get some goals. Let's get some wins and quite possibly a clean sheet. Hi there, everybody. Glad you can join us today. Martin Tyler and Alan Smith for you on this Halloween evening. You don't win anything, Alan, do you, for being top at this stage of the season? But it's... Uh, Quite a, an experience to enjoy, particularly for the fans when the league table is published, and they will go top if they win. Well, they've been pretty good, haven't they? More than pretty good, really. Very the consistent. Leeds United lineup. Responsibility for some of those five in midfield to get forward, and uh, I'm sure the the main striker won't be isolated. Although it looks a bit like that on our screens. Yeah, he could be a lonely man up top there if he doesn't get the support that uh, he needs because. He is the type of player that does need support. He can't okay. do it all on his own. Mark Roas, Alfonso Davis, dream team. I think Timothy Way might have to go back in the lineup. Davis loses possession. Oh, that was a, that would have been a good start. Did well, stuck out a foot, and cut off the pass. Yes, here we go, Max Ahrens. Get my way, Mark Roas. Oh, what a save! That's a brill save that was from the goalkeeper. Be soon, the Champions League fixture. Blackburn Rovers. Oh, yes. Go on, Roas. Get in there, Roas, son. Roas. Oh, he's missed. He's flipping missed. Oh, that was... That was I'm shot that would have gone in anyway. But get it. Josh King. Lovely. Out the Bradley Dak. Oh, Alfonso. Well, it makes a good How are we not? Oh, I, 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 <laughs> this is infuriating, man. This is infuriating. It really is. Ah, oh, this is taking the mech. Ah, uh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! What the hell? Did anyone just see that? Did anyone just see Delitz burst for no reason? Did anyone just see that? That was ridiculous. I can't believe I just witnessed that. Delit just did a random burst forward. Well, they're going to go in Watch him now. Watch him. Look. Whoosh. Just runs forward. Yeah, the task for the goal Why did he just do that? Why on earth has he just done that? I cut that. That's... Oh, that's ridiculous. EA have done something to this game since I last played it. So I'm playing two episodes in two days, and this is this is phenomenal. Hidaguchi. And the away. Slipping it through. Oh, here we go with through on goal. Yes, come on! There it is! Freaking deserve! 
I don't know what's wrong with this gameplay, but something is not right well, whatsoever really at match. all. Something is not right. I can promise you that right now, that is mental how difficult this game is right now. The first touch, everything. That was a good save. Zaniolo and he had a ton alley. Oh, it's cleared. Max Adams with an absolute awful first touch. Ton alley at the Zaniolo. The lit. Freaking playing up front now, the lit is apparently. Whips that in onto our left back. Yes, we've scored. We've put it into the back of the net. We have been putting on the pressure for the last 85 minutes, to say the least. But we finally bag ourselves a goal. Oh, guys. This game is so difficult. It really is. The last few, few games have been absolute mental. But two no defenders, one assist and one goal. Oh, I, it just wasn't, it hasn't been going our way. This 4-1-1 four, four, one, one formation is working really well in minute. But it's been so difficult, really difficult. We've won, finally. We haven't lost for ages, but we haven't won either. So it's finally good to actually pick up some three points. And, of course, if Manchester United lose, we go top of the table. But that was, guys, that game was so difficult. Really, really difficult. Honestly, I don't know what it's been, but every chance we've had is just not going in. The defensive issues, it's been ridiculous. Like, I noticed, I watched back their goal, and it switched to delete for some reason. And as I was controlling one other player, it switched to delete, and that's the reason he belted forward, which, of course, caught us off guard. But, unbelievable, in all fairness. Absolutely unbelievable. Dominated that game. Delete with a 9.1 to him. That's because of the assist that he's uh, had in <laughs> that particular game. But finally, to get ourselves a goal, Joshua King on the score sheet, um, which is good there, in all fairness. But this is really difficult. I mean, let's have a look at this league table. We're top of the league. Manchester United are yet to play, though, guys, just so you know. Uh, I think they will be playing Leicester City by the looks of things. Just looking at the table. Or they could be playing Chelsea down in 11th. Unfortunately, I can't actually see... They're playing Wolves. They're playing Wolves. So that could be interesting. Um, or they're playing Leicester. I really don't know, if I'm honest. But I have to say, it's good now. We are kind of still in our mix a little bit. Picked up a win finally. Hopefully we can beat Leverkusen right now as well. Uh, which would be absolutely huge. But I, I have to say, we're struggling. I am tempted to try a different formation against Leverkusen. But we are going to be going out with a weakened side. That's a big thing. But... As you can see there, we beat Leverkusen and we are close to qualifying for the knockout stages, in all fairness. But before that, before I pick the team, let's jump into a training session and let's see who we should do today. I'm actually going to do Timothy Way once again, whilst I'm going to do Ton Alley. But uh, let's see if he actually goes up a bit. He goes up quite a lot, actually, trying to get him to do 80 rated because then we can kind of get the ball rolling a bit there with his actual stats, and we want to kind of get him up to the same height as Joshua King. Adam Armstrong kicking off. Um, was going to give him a run around, but I'm not sure if that's going to happen. But let's change this side around, because a lot of tiredness. Max Ahrens is going to have to be dropped. We are going to put... Actually, you know what? I'm going to put the second side out a second. Let me just bring the second side up. But I'm going to put a couple of players different. So, Billin is, of course, not going to be playing because he's awful. But let's find uh, Travis, who will be starting. I forgot about Joswick. I forgot we actually have him. Um, we will be keeping at Padu. Lenian, we're going to drop for Delet. Noyu can drop as well. Uh, we'll put our left back in that position there. So, Vark can actually go back in the lineup. Uh, Zaniola, Barry Vanham, no, we're not going to do that. Uh, let me see what other midfielders I actually have. I don't have many, to be fair. So it's kind of the best options. But uh, I'm going to put Gray Leash on. Because he's 82 rated. And Zaniolo. Wilson, Armstrong, Way going to start. Do I start Roas? No, he's too tired. Um, and do I actually bring... I might put Joswick on the bench for Tonali. Because I'm having enough for... I can put Lenin on if I wanted. Bradley Danko in midfield. 
Uh, we've got quite a lot of variety there, in all fairness, guys. But uh, not going to be changing them there. I'm actually going to bring on Chapman as well for... Oh, no. Nah, I'm going to leave that like that. So that's the side we've gone out with in the Champions League. Bit of a weak and weak team. We still don't have a strong side. Like, we really don't. Like, even that's our first team, which is still really low rated, in all fairness. Um, but let's try this out. Let's play by Leverkusen. Let's see how it goes. And welcome on a rainy night. The heavens opened earlier, and it just hasn't relented. Oh, lovely. Armstrong on his left foot. Oh, he scores with Wendell at Adam Armstrong. Begging to be played. Wanted to be loaned out in January. And we end up making it 1-0. An absolute brilliant goal with the Ronaldo celebration. FYI, I don't know how I did that. But 32 minutes in, we take the lead with an absolute roulette of a finish in that top right-hand corner. Playing absolutely brilliantly at the minute. What a goal. Look at that, top corner, post this stamp. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Henderson has it. This is the issue we had last time, we can see this straight after, but right now we've... That's fucking just, that is, look, look at that. In that wide position. Away. Ooh, we've got rid of it, Brill. Okay, that's good. For that, I generally thought when at Padu did that dodgy touch that ball. it was going to go against us. Walker Peters, is he going to punish them here? Clattered oh, away. come on! Luis Alberto, Luis Alberto, and a goal! The ball just bounces. It's happened every time. Watch it. Watch the replay. Well, I just love to look at Watch this. Gary, dodgy chest for some reason. And ball literally really just bounces really and all none of my defenders are there. Slightly different vantage point Such, in terms oh, of the goal scored. Every time. It's guaranteed to concede straight after I score. Guaranteed. Well, there's never a bad time Come to on, score Nosky. a goal, but Lovely. just before half time can be crucial. And he's got his team. Oh, I'm strong! What a save. That was... Um, and scope for them to produce oh, this exciting. is ridiculous. We are, look at our fitness, man. Oh, 2-1. Our fitness is gone. Fitness is gone. John Anderson again. Well, 2-1 it is here. The Nothing going our way. Here we go, Alfonso Davis. Pick that out. Come on. 78 minutes just brought him on as well. Answer straight back. Peace. I'm literally just going to put through balls to him now. I'm skipping this. I'm getting forward. Come on, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Last few games has been the first touch. The amount of times we've been overdone because of the first touch. Is phenomenal. Oh, look at this. What a goal! <laughs> Come on! That's how we do it. Oh, I thought we was down and out then. We were down and out five minutes ago. We really were. Like the winner. What a run from Alfonso. Well, he's not a brilliant that, goal, but it's a goal. That. In the back of the net. We got to try and keep our head now for the last five minutes. That was brilliant. Easily a goal of the episode if we did that. That's amazing. Yes, lad. What the? Running towards goal. One man to beat. Has to be surely. Oh, what a save. What a save. Uh, that, that's scripting all over, that is. That is literally scripting all over. Completely against me. Look at that. What a save, though. It's from Savar in the 90th minute. we got to get rid of this, though. Or that save means nothing. Big, big clear and straight on to... Yes, Savar. Well, foul. Come on. We've beaten by Leverkusen. That was a huge result. Absolutely huge. Coming a point clear. We're still... 
be a point clear. Oh, that was huge. That was brilliant. That impact sub, Alfonso Davis, I wasn't going to put him on. I was going to put Joswick on. And he had two attempts and two goals. That's bro. I, I am I am exhausted of our group right now. Top by one point. Of course, we have two games left. We will be playing by Leverkusen. I think if we beat by Leverkusen, we essentially confirm our qualification spot um, into the knockout stages, which is huge. So, yeah, that'll be interesting. So, hopefully, we beat them. That means even if Leverkusen win, yeah, we, we end up qualifying. So, we beat Juve next episode. That is all going to be going down. But I have to say, guys, I don't know what it is. Right, I'm going to have a little kind of a constructive rant right now. But the first touch over the last two episodes, there, are, there was an update recently. So I don't know if that's a factor. But the first touch on a lot of my players has been atrocious. Absolutely atrocious. I don't know if that's due to tiredness or anything like that. I just don't know. But nevertheless... We go into national break. We'll be simming our last game next episode when we play those three current games lined up for you all in one week. Um, but yeah, I have to say the first touch of proper killed us. Like they by Leverkusen's goal, one of their goals. Uh, Navy had a dodgy chest for some reason. I just don't understand how that happened, but it did. It happened, um, and it's been struggling. We haven't lost um, for ages, but we've drawn a lot of games, conceding a lot of goals. Um, so, only Manchester United and Blackburn are the only teams not to lose yet in the league. But we've, we've drawn our extra game and we can see seven goals this season. So, we need to sort that out. I don't know whether to change the formation. I might go back to two central midfielders and one tack midfielder and go from there. I got a feeling that might be our issue. And we'll look at that next episode, guys. But anyway, guys, my name is Golanzio. Thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, hit that like button. Of course, if you want to see any more of the series or more videos from me, hit that subscribe button. Guys, I'll see you at 6 on Sunday. Bye-bye.